director Ronald Pickup, best known for his roles in the best exotic Marigold Hotel films and TV drama Orwell on Jura, has died at the age his agent confirmed. Ronald Pickup actor aged 80 passed away peacefully yesterday after a long illness surrounded by his wife. He will be deeply missed. Out. Ronald is survived by his wife Lance Traverse, who he married in 1964, and daughter, Rachel Pickup, an actress, and son Simon. The esteemed star was trained at Royal Academy of Dramatic Art, RADA, where he met his wife, and went on to become an associate member of the prestigious theaters. The actor then joined Olivier National Theatre Company at the Old Vic and was well known for his work on the stage before moving on to enjoy an illustrious television and film career. Ronald began his TV career back in 1964 with his first big appearance being in Doctor Who, where he played a physician in Part 4 of The Rain. Following his first appearance, he then went on to star in Hornblower, Coronation Street, Boyle's War, Midsummer Murders, Doc Martin, Waking the Dead, Silent Witness, Sherlock Holmes, The Bill, Inspector Morse, and the He is best known for his role in the British Indian comedies, Best Exotic Marigold Hotel in 2011 and the second Best Exotic Marigold Hotel in 2015, where he starred alongside Celia Imrie, Judy Dench, and Diana. He played the role of Norman Cousins, and H. Lothario, in the film which centers around a group of British pensioners relocating to a retirement hotel in India, which is run by the very eager Sunny, played by Dev Patel. In 2012, he spoke about what attracted him to the role of Norman, saying, What appealed to me about the character was the fact that he is not good at what he would like to be and that is being this lounge lizard and successful. He tries these awful chat up lines and things that he thinks are in some way attractive but he is just really bad. He tries too hard and that gives him a vulnerability that I found appealing and there is something kind of desperate. His film career also included his role as Prime Minister Neville Chamberlain in 2017's The Darkest Hour and as a government official in 1980. Never say he starred with his daughter Rachel in two productions, Midsummer Murders episode The Magician's Nephew in 2008 and 2016 Schadenfreude. Ronald had the huge accolade of working with Laurence Olivier at the Royal National Theatre, in Three Sisters and Long Day's Journey into In 1998, he was nominated for the Laurence Olivier Theatre Award for Best Performance in a Supporting Role for his performance in 2014. Pickup had a cameo in Coronation Street, playing an OAP attending a birthday party at the Rover's Return with Michelle Connor, played by Kim Mar. In 2016, he played the role of Jeffrey Fisher, the Archbishop of Canterbury, in four episodes of the Netflix series The Crown. The following year in 2017, Pickup played Prime Minister Neville Chamberlain in Oscar-winning World War II movie, Dark as most recently, the actor starred in the horror film End of Term just last year, which starred former Doctor Who actor Peter Davis. In 2006, Ronald spoke to Rogues and Vagabonds about where his on-stage skills come from and if he was born to play the part, my mother was always theatrical she was a wonderful man. she loved theater down in Chester where I was born, she was brought up in a house which was next door to the old royalty theater, a beautiful little Victorian gem, now sad she loved it. But she was too terrified to take acting up professionally. When asked if he surprised his parents with his on-stage desires, he went on, I don't think my mother was, surprised. She sensed it because I'd been interested from about the age of eight. They took me to see Hamlet with a I was absolutely enthralled. My father was more cautious. He was a teacher slash lecturer in French and English at a teacher's training college. I think he was worried, as that generation were, of having something to fall. But, on the whole, they were cute.